So what do you do when you run out of excuses? Do you actually make up some more or you stay and fight or do the thing that you said you would want to do so bad? Well, such is the case that has brought me here today. If you're watching this video, my name is Kwame and I do make videos like this as well as sometimes having conversations with my wife or traveling and other videos that may come up in the lifestyle realm of YouTube and that's what I do. So if you're new here, you're welcome to my channel and I hope you enjoy this conversation that we're about to have today, Sunday evening. I have run out of excuses and I'll tell you why or I'll tell you how that happened. So a couple of months ago, or should I say over a year ago, a little over a year ago, I decided to embark on this journey of freelance filmmaking, voiceover, and being, you know, an all-round freelance creative. And I've made several, several excuses about not having the things that I need. And everything that I've wanted to do is tied to acquiring something else to be able to achieve it or make it better. And sometimes I do go through a lot with trying to convince, especially my wife, that yes, I do need these things. And is what will make my work much, much better. You know, I want to become a better filmmaker, a documentary filmmaker for that matter. And I need this, I need that. So I started my journey with a Canon 80D and that's what I've been making. <clears throat> I've I'd made my videos all the way up until October 2020 when I changed to the Canon RP. And all this while I've, I've just been, you know, making excuses about, you know, not starting certain documentary projects because they were too big to be done with the Canon ATD or the Canon RP. I have done client jobs with those cameras and those cameras have been amazing for that particular time or the job that I did, clients were super satisfied, satisfied with it and all that. But I have some personal projects that I've been thinking of making and I just don't want to make them with certain cameras or yeah, I just didn't want to do it until I had what I wanted. And here we are <laughs> recording a video with what I've always wanted, uh, an entry level cinema camera, which I currently have now. And what I'm here today to talk about this Sunday before we go into the new week is, yes, I am terrible at this particular thing that I'm talking about. And at the moment, well, as a creative, if you are a creative like me and you suffer from perfectionism, you want things to be a certain way before you even do it, all the excuses you can make in this world, what do you do when you've run out of those excuses now that you have what you want and you know that when you get what you want it doesn't automatically mean that everything falls into place and you're all of a sudden the best filmmaker or the best photographer or the best dancer or the best music creator ever so what happens then and I have to tell you one thing that yes indeed there's always going to be the argument that, you know, there's always that gear doesn't matter or this doesn't matter, whatever it is. There's always going to be that argument. But for some level of work, yes, it means that you need certain things to make it easier. But when you get those things, trust me, the feeling does fade very quickly. And then now you're left with you standing between you and all the things that you said you would do. Are you going to do it? Are you going to push through? Or are you going to keep making excuses about other things before you start anything? So yeah, that's where we are today. <sighs> Filming on the Blackmagic Cinema Pocket 4K. And um, I have run out of excuses. So until I catch you again in another video, do it with what you have while you wait. Don't sit and wait for what you need before you begin. I hope it works out for you and I'm rooting for you. I hope you have an amazing week. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to also subscribe to my channel and I'll catch you in the next one. I've run out. Peace.